zoomed in, so like I like this half of your face, like the top part. You have to go like really low. It's like down here. There you go. <laughs> we got some rosemary. Oh, hold on. Okay, there you go. We got some rosemary thyme chopped up with some garlic. I'm gonna add that to our room temperature butter. Seasonings, smoked paprika, sage, black pepper, rosemary, Italian blend, garlic powder. <laughs> can you see me? Uh, the bowl? Yes, you can see the bowl. Mix it all this shit up together real good. Get that in there. Oh yeah. <laughs> I just smell the goodness in that. Yeah, get all that in there real good. Real good. Real good. All real all good. Get some, yeah. Brought some salt. A little bit of salt. About yeah, much. Go ahead and decide. You want to see a professional chef chop garlic as opposed to me? Watch this. Oh, you're crazy. I'm not, not professional at all. <laughs> Wash your meat. <laughs> Don't beat the meat, wash the meat. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. You can move the sponge. Start, start in a hole. <laughs> oh my god, it's so gross. I know, right? I think it's only gross because I'm pregnant, so it's like it looks really gross. Check out the insides. I like how they tuck the uh <laughs> that's where the neck is. Yep. Well it's actually inside probably. Yep. And there's somewhere in the bag. Oh my god! Should we film a TikTok really fast? It's a penis! <laughs> it's Hold a on. penis! Hold on, I gotta. <laughs> Hold on, wait, 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 wait. I gotta do this. Okay. Hold on. Two seconds. Blaze, go outside! I don't want you barking in my TikTok. Okay, go. What the fuck is in there? Ew! <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> the penis came off. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. <laughs> 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 so that, that's in there? 
Always make sure that you clean, clean the inside of your turkey and take out all the parts. Sometimes the parts come in bags and sometimes they don't. There's nothing in there. Just the neck. Weird. Because sometimes it comes with the, the giblets and the liver. How come this one didn't? Maybe they stopped putting the giblets and the liver in there. I guess so. That shouldn't be a thing though. Well, we're going to chop this neck off and cook it in the broth for the dogs. I can stay up there. Looking all weird. <laughs> Fancy like a penis from a turkey. Clean towel. Dry your shit off. All the way. With a dry ass turkey. That you I smell something good. How you doing, kitty? Pull this fish down all over. Rub your meat. Rub your meat. Rub it thoroughly. Give it a little smack so you know that you love it. <laughs> yep. Smack the turkey dash. The oil everywhere, wing and all, right? Don't be afraid of this shit. I have to put that on pause. And if you have cats, make sure that they don't uh, attack the turkey. Like this demon guy right here. Make sure he's for, far for away. Sure, for sure. This shit can get kind of greasy and oily. So I like to wear gloves. And don't steal gloves from the doctor's office like I do. Like what we do. <laughs> Fuck it. They're free. They get plenty of them. So. Yep. Tax write off. Damn, are these small? Medium? They're mediums. Jesus Christ. They didn't have any large or extra large. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> no, I know. Pan man. Oh, they can't see you. Hold on. There you go. <laughs> and now you do not have to put gloves on the uh, turkey uh, penis. Light my shirt. Just want to pet your dog, man. Season this bitch. Good. Season this bitch all over his mug, alright? Get your wings. Chicken wing, chicken wing. Chicken wing, chicken wing. Chicken wing, chicken wing. And do not stick the turkey on your head if you have a bigger turkey than this. By the way, this is a 13 pound turkey, AKA 12.77, so 13 pounds. But if you if you know what I'm talking about with the turkey on your head, comment. If you don't, then well, it's a 90s sitcom TV show called Friends. Look it up. You can dance with your turkey if you so choose to, though. See, see how you're seasoning this? You want all this shit inside of there. All right. I mean, the dry ass turkeys, we're gonna saw that shit. And unflavorful turkeys, definitely saw right here. Next year we're getting either uh, deep fried turkey or we're gonna smoke it. Yes. Not sure yet, but that's next year. See all that seasonings here? The leftovers, Oops. right in a fucking hole. Stuff it in there, stuff Just it like in that, there. Just like that, baby. Now, I forgot to chop an onion too. Key part. Work your hand up. Under the skin. Ah, hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. 
<laughs> and do not take the skin off and put it as a face mask, all you trendy people. No, because you kind of want the skin off. Leave your skin on here, <laughs> fucking weirdos. We do not eat Tide Pods. We do not use turkey skin as a mask. See. Why are you doing this, you say? It's where your butter's coming in at, folks. Use a little bit of the seasoning. Leave inside your, of your butter. Get underneath your skin. Throw that bitch inside of here. You want to work it all the way inside and out? The sound of it is mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. And then. You see all the lumpies? You gotta yeah. smooth out the lumpies. Well, that's how you can work it, the butter in there. So. Stage. Where's that bad boy up? And, and if you guys don't have string, the way they come, you can tuck the legs back into the hole. Like so. Fucking done, right, baby. So this is the turkey pan. That I it's dishwashed last night. And hopefully this turkey. This big ass turkey here. Will fit in that pan. We shall find out. Oh yes. We don't have any spray oil anymore, but hey. We're gonna take this other board. Okay. If you're wondering why we got a 13 pound turkey for two of us, well one, because I could probably eat half of that turkey being pregnant myself, and two, because leftovers. We're triplets, guys. And um, that, don't know. if any of our neighbors um, or my mom wants some, you know. Oh yes, this is how you're supposed to cut an onion, by the way. I have not mastered this. Somehow, Every time I cut onions, I cringe when I watch my videos back. Why? Because this is the professional way. It dices them evenly. And somehow, I cannot figure out how to. Easiest way? You cut an onion in half. Stand up on the flattest side. Make two cuts. One cut. Two cut. And I do that. Lay it down. Turn to the side. One cut. Two cut. Well, sometimes it falls apart, but then you turn it, and then you go chop it. Yeah, and somehow my mine falls apart every time. So oh. that's how you're supposed to cut an onion. And somehow shove it in there, shove it in there. <laughs> God no. <laughs> twenty twenty pour it up. <laughs> hey babe, why? <laughs> you, you know, this is the day. <laughs> What's up, guys? Jay Blaze here. Doing your onions and your turkey. You want to shove them in there. 2020 Pornhub style. <laughs> All done. Let's go. You're, you're the turkey god. You, you do you. Oh, only, you turkey, want, uh, they're turkey on the second shelf. Well, only chicken. Yes, where's the chicken? Second shelf. Spices. Uh, this is awesome. yes. These are kind of weak. Yes. Yes. I'm going to add like a half an hour. Well, not that much. <laughs> yes. By the way, three twenty-five is what you want your turkey set on. Yes. Slow, More. slow, slower cooking is better. 
So for a 13 pound turkey, it should be about three hours, give or take. Okay, three, three, and all, three hours or three hours and 45 minutes. But the hint is you want to the last about 140 degrees temperature wise, between 130 and 140, you want to take the turkey cover off for the last 20 degrees. About 15 to 20 minutes. This is what prepping looks like on Thanksgiving. <laughs> I'll shut my mess. Boy, oh, please. I know, Rick. If you did not make a mess, check it out. Beautiful. Beautiful. Mwah. <laughs> In the all of it. Might want to take out the top rack. Yep. <laughs> Just realized that. Da -da -da. Here's your sign. <laughs> Coke is off for everybody, kids. Don't try this at home. I'm gonna wash that thing, man. No, that'd be good, man. Beautiful. Take out your racks. Put your one in the mi the midway point. Fucking gorgeous, just like so. And then there go my ego. And then we wait. Well, actually, while that's cooking, in about another two hours or so, he's going to get started on the potatoes, mashed. which mashed potatoes, and then the homemade mac and cheese, and the green bean casserole won't take very long. That's basically dump and bake or reheat, and then we have to cook the pumpkin pie. We have a frozen pumpkin pie, but everything over here is what we have left. Somewhere, if you guys could see that. I did make the stuffing, as you guys saw. Which I have to reheat up, but that won't take very long. So, yep. All right. Jeez. A little, a little more out that there. And then I'm just going to bake these for myself. Yes. I'll clean them off and I'll... Shave them down. Them yeah. Shave them down because I don't want the roots. You got a cutter? Uh, peeler? Yes, second drawer. Somewhere in there. <laughs> yeah, in my junk drawer of unorganized. The peeler, that actually really does work. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing. But <laughs> uh. You want to flick it out of the wall? Of course that white people cannot make mac and cheese. It is a fucking lie. Let's go. Best part of uh, pasta is when you throw it to the wall if it sticks or except not for sticks. Except for that's the American way. <laughs> that's the fun way. 75% <laughs> cooked. Dump it in here immediately. Yes, always. I do immediately shock it. Cold water. And this is your uh, pasta spaghetti. Yes. Um, yes. It will stop the cooking process. It will shock the mac and cheese, and because it's gonna cook for 30 minutes into the oven, and also. Take it out and top it with more cheese. About another 15 minutes, 20 minutes into the oven again. Hot. Not that kind. <laughs> That's the lighter video. <laughs> Butter. Heavy whipping cream. This is not a 420 friendly video. Why not? Not right now. <laughs> not, well, it, we're always 420 friendly. Because it should be legal everywhere. Where's your flower, baby? Uh, up there somewhere. Good question, where? Uh, probably in the back. Take everything out. It's up behind lemon juice. Or lime juice. Coconut ice. <laughs> I'm like, I know it's in there somewhere. 
flour. The other white stuff. Melt down that butter, baby. Butter biscuits. You wanna say hi, everybody? Come here. Hi. Don't touch my hands. Oh, you good boy. I know, I'm gonna go baby. Here's my little baby. <laughs> I know, don't hit daddy's hands. <laughs> All right. Melt down this butter. We got heavy cream. We're gonna slowly add to it. And flour. Hence, your roux. Let's go on with this fucking grating of the cheeses over here. The cheese is going. Boom. You can buy this anywhere. My mom got me that for Fucking the best, Christmas, I think. Best thing ever. Amazon. Yeah. You always want to go fresh, cheddar, but we're doing it the cheap way too. I've got some mozzarella already shredded and sharp, sharp cheddar. And it's super sharp, sharp cheddar right here. Mozzarella. I'm gonna do like a quarter at a time. Oops. <laughs> Jeez. I went the other way. Wrong way, Dildo. That was a spill. Whoa! Well, that ain't supposed to happen. Let's go. I've done that before too. Have you? Yes. This is why uh, that wasn't locked all the way. Whoops. Okay. I'm gonna edit this shit out, right? <laughs> Cooking fails. Oh. Cooking fails. All right. Still doesn't compare to my uh, me exploding the uh, dish with the. Uh, <laughs> Did you really? Remember my stuffed pepper video? Yes. <laughs> why? Am I missing a locking mechanism? No. It doesn't lock. You're yeah, it just... does. It's locked now. No. Let's go. I was like, I don't know. I just... There we go. Cooking fails part one. Mix that bad boy up just like that. You dig? Let's go. cream sauce here. Oh yeah, get that thickness in there. Quarantine thick! <laughs> Ain't no nasty mac and cheese fucking this time, baby. Well, uh, I eyeball shit all the uh, time. Check the consistency if it's too thick. Add some love to it. That's, what she said. That's definitely what she said. It's not good. Actually, let's do a little check on it. Pre-check. We don't have one of those, what is it called? Meat thermometers, but. No. I'll know whenever it's done. That's oh, because yeah. he is pro chef. Pro chef. Oop, my camera's fogging up from the. Yeah, it will. Look at that, good, that goodness. Smell that bad? Smell, well, I can smell, smell it. That. Smell good, don't. Let's go. Boy. The best thing about these old school things, every grandma and mom has one in her kitchen, is that uh, it heats up and holds heat inside that pan. That's exactly what you want all day. Like a weird. Oh, there's something on my camera, that's why. I was like, what's on my camera? What? Moisture. Oh. It's getting hot in here. I always add a little salt and pepper, obvious, for obvious reasons. A little garlic powder. I don't want to do too much though. 
That's the key ingredients. Salt and pepper is the key ingredients to life. For sure. Unless you're like me and you just things are and already. How you things. incorporate things and when. As Gordon Ramsay would say, salt. You're gonna do the um. You're the, salt to taste it. You're gonna do the. Uh, wait, hold on. Hold on. Wait, wait, hold on. <laughs> yeah. So, hold on. mac and cheese. There you go. Ain't creamy like like this. You fucking up, son. Get that bad baby off the heat. Hurt, right, chef. Chat. I guess I could sit here and peel my potatoes. Look at that. Oh yeah, that's how good it is right here. All right. While we're done. Hurt, right, chef. <laughs> Three and third. We're gonna have to tag Gordon Ramsay in this bitch. If he dares say something rude, be like, bitch, you better check with Chef Andre because I worked at your fucking restaurant. But a few months, two months before he was gonna make a visit, you make your base, you mix up all the macaroni inside. And this part right here is for left for the layers, the middle first layer, set then the very top layer. Bruh. 
Jesse. Jim made pie. Wow. You guys don't know? <laughs> well, it's not that poor waka waka waka. Yep. <laughs> Like warm apple pie. <laughs> well, I don't think it's giving this like warm pumpkin pie. Cancel <laughs> yeah, so that one. Bake. Made with real butter. Yes. Now the mac and cheese goes in. Boom. Potatoes are boiling for mashed potatoes. Mm. Oh yeah, some juice is in there. Still got one. Oh yeah. I do, but I'm too lazy. So it's nice and melted and incorporated. God damn, look at that. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, it really didn't work out that well. That's okay. Did you want to take a picture of it first? Or whatever? Yeah, fuck it, why not? I went ahead and mixed the green beans. All I have to do is make them. By the way, you're not a real man if you don't make sword jokes with this or penis jokes. Are we grow up at the top? 80s? I was going to say it was siblings. Right. Green bean casserole. Should be good.
Look at that tenderness. That juiciness. Boy. Let's go.